hundred movie theaters in Toronto. And they were spread on Queen Street. Every block or two was a movie theater. People would take stores and convert them to movie theaters. So I used to go around. I would start at Queen and Young and walk all the way to Roncesvalles one night a week, and I'd canvas every theater to sell my picture postcards. The next day I would start at Young Street and go all the, walk all the way to the beach. You couldn't ride, you couldn't take, I didn't have a car, of course I'm 12 years old, and you, and you couldn't take streetcars because there's a theater every block or two. Well, that, that's what I did, I, I, I canvassed those theaters. And anyway, I built up, a, I have been built up pretty good following. So, um, and uh, let me finish. And, and um, that summer, they had a fire at the Dominion and Boston Printing Company, and they decided they didn't want to bother with this. And I already had a, a, a slew of customers. So I went, I went to the film exchanges and I collected 30 different pictures of movie stars, 12 years old. And then I went to the photo engravers and had plates made. They were like a postcard size. Right. Then we took 30 of these and put them all together and print on a big sheet of paper. It wasn't, it was not just ordinary paper, it was special coated stock. Right. And I printed up a whole bunch of these and I took it to the, print, the printer and he cut them up and put them all in boxes. So it would be 500 in a box. And he kept them in stock there. And every week I would go around, and I would, later on I told you I didn't have to go around, but at the beginning I used to go around the theaters and, get, and they'd print their program for next week. Okay. And they would give them out, either they'd distribute them to the houses or they'd give them out in the theater. Now the women used to save them. If you went into a woman's house, there, there was a, she had all these movies in, in her vanity table. All around they put up these pictures of the movie stars. As I said, there was no movie magazine. People wanted to see pictures. 